Zach Ritzone is here for Computer Dealer News at the Consumer Electronics Show in Las Vegas. And as you might expect, TVs are front and center with new technologies that might have implications in the boardroom. We're going to go in and take a look. CES has always been flooded with TVs in the form of prototypes and market-ready models set to roll out to consumers, both of which have new and unique technologies to showcase. The theme this year isn't as clearly defined, though internet-connected TVs and TV applications continue the trend of the last two years as the most dominant feature. But this year also saw the unveiling of technologies like 4K, which is four times the resolution of 1080p high definition, the current industry standard. Glassless 3D made a few more strides, while other proprietary concept technologies were on display as well. And a couple of 55-inch OLED displays were prominent, but don't expect them to hit the market this year. The underlying theme that ties into connectivity, however, is that the increasingly thinner profile and added functionality is offering new options like Sharp's Aquas Board, a TV that doubles as a digital whiteboard perfect for corporate environments. While doodling may be fun on such a big canvas, it's the internet and productivity tools that makes the TV all the more interesting. In fact, the Aquas Board should be available in the new 80-inch LED TV Sharp unveiled before the show. It would seem TV manufacturers are looking to be particularly relevant in the corporate world too, even if they aren't always explicit in saying so. But how that will actually play out in 2012 will be hard to gauge for now. Despite how beautiful these TVs look, the technology behind them is prohibitively expensive to bring to market right now, and that could change in the next few years. For Computer Dealer News, I'm Tech Ritzonis from the Consumer Electronics Show in Las Vegas.